situation a little bit interesting, right? There are some guys that make sense. The top two, Kyler Murray and Patrick Mahomes. Okay. That's kind of what we thought. But what about Dak Prescott and Lamar Jackson and all the other guys we drafted right behind them? No, instead, the third QB in fantasy is Tom Brady, who's what? as old as Adam Rank. Wait, uh, and then he's, he's also <laughs> kind of good. <laughs> okay, Tom Brady is good. Let me be clear. Tom Brady is good. But Tom Brady hasn't been a top three fantasy quarterback in a lot of our eyes. Now, I'm no Cynthia Freeland. I can try to be, and once we have her on the show, she can probably break this down statistically like I try to. But I think if Next Gen Stats looked at his uh, passing game uh, as a Tampa Bay Buccaneer in comparison to him at the New, New England Patriots, he is spreading the ball a lot more efficiently. He actually has the targets to get there. You see him going to Mike Evans. You see him going to Antonio Brown. You see him hitting Rob Gronkowski. The thing is, they returned all 22 starters. They won a Super what? Bowl. First time I'm hearing this. First time, no just like the longest season ever. First time we've ever heard it. They're returning all their starters. Tom Brady hungry for yet another Super Bowl ring. So he's actually good at fantasy football, which is shocking. And then uh, Daniel Dimes was also on that list. I know uh, Marcus was, was that, mentioned was, him Was earlier. that a mistake? He snuck on the board? Uh, you know, I know it's good. It's very surprising. <laughs> uh, and then Jalen, the club. Jalen Hurts, which is interesting because we thought maybe this was just going to be a scenario from last season. He got those four starts at the end of the season. He was very good at fantasy football. But we wondered, could he keep it up? It looks like he can actually keep it up. And though he's good through the air, he's targeting Devonta Smith. He's also running the ball. He has the second most rushing yards per quarterbacks, 144 rushing yards to be exact through the first two weeks of the season. The main thing that I wanted to point out about all of this is that Patrick Mahomes and Kyler Murray, very obvious, but to have Tom Brady, Daniel Tom Brady. Jones, uh, this, and Jalen Hurts, it's a little bit interesting. This Tom Brady guy just snuck onto this list. <laughs> it's almost as if Mike Evans and Chris Godwin are better than Jacoby Myers. I don't know. I mean, I know. It's crazy, but this just goes to show you don't have to necessarily reach to get a fantasy quarterback. You could have one of these guys who were probably late-round pickups who turn out to be pretty darn good at fantasy football through week two. A uh, lot, lot of value. A lot, lot of value. Maybe, maybe it also says Byron Left, which maybe better than Josh McDaniels? I don't, I don't know. Oh, I don't know. Hot take, hot take.